we are not interested in agriculture. We are not, we are, we are, we are wanting to be a non-agricultural economy. And we should understand this, that this pandemic is all about food. When you centralize governance and eulogize only one person, only one leader, knows all, instructing political gods and those who dissent are chained, jails and are anti-national. Democracy, basic bed is to be able to dialogue and listen. When public investment increases on defense and speed toys rather than agriculture, education, health. If you see the last 10 years, our investment on education, health and agriculture is decreasing. The defense expenditure is increasing. What is this frame that we are wanting to build a nation? We will invest in high speed trains um, when migrants have to walk. This is the contradiction that the polarity with which we deal with it. When hate multiplies and love diminishes. We now even are getting some state to do a law on love jihad, which means young men and women have to first bother about their religion before they get married to each other. I can ask this question. When justice is available to the rich and the jails are filled with three times the percentage of population of tribal, Dalits and Muslims, we are building an edifice of a society which criminalizes poor and legitimizes poverty. It is in this context that the Green Catalysts have to talk of the need to look at man's relationship or human being's relationship with the environment. Uh, and lastly, I won't take much of your time. Um, therefore, what is the job? We need young leaders like you who focus on decentralizing the arts. Therefore, it's at the grassroots, at the, at the operational level that people have to start looking at green have to start looking at saving their environment rather than the big picture which I think is at the moment not in our hands. Therefore, focus on decentralizing governance, truly the will of the people by the people. Focus on food and agriculture-based economy. We have to reimagine our health-based infrastructure, sub-centers. If you want to use technology, then we have to bring technology in health sector and not in games and toys. We have to have enabling technologies and not subjugating technology. Uh, focusing on primary and vocational education based on sub-regional markets and value-based leadership. I think that's what Mahesh is trying to do with all of you. Be in your spaces, be leaders in your space, but I mean, understand the larger reality but operate at your local level. Remember, human hands, including soft staff persons, artists, have to be valued more than white-collared middlemen. I mean, look at what is happening to agriculture. Those who labor, they get less, and clerks are getting more. Where, what is this? People who produce food are getting less, and people who are pushing pens and files are and answering on computers are very good. We have to slow down. Speed and time are not commodities for subjugation. And towards the end, I would just say, as young people, focus on learning to learn, constantly adapting, listening to what's happening, but focusing on your leadership, your confidence, and not getting overawed by the big subjugating technologies that are pushed at us. I'll stop here. I really wish you all the very, very best. Um, as a green captain, there's another thing. You have to be building a movement and not a project. This is what uh, I think we need to start looking at. Thank you very much for the opportunity um, to all of you and all the best uh, for your work ahead. Over back to you. Thank you so much.